Hello, good morning. I'm everyone. here with my good friend Nicolas Dubrocard, who is an expert in uh, sustainability. He's an auditor working for the leading uh, labels. One of them is uh, Green Globe, and he's going around the hotels and auditing them, analyzing what they are doing, what is their level of uh, sustainability, and creating roadmaps on how they can improve themselves. Uh, he's also an expert in elephant conservation, coming up with incredible criteria, assessing what makes a good or a bad elephant camp. That's not the topic for today, but that's just to introduce uh, Nicolas. And he's had uh, multiple uh, responsibilities at a high level with some key uh, labels. So it's a really great honor. He loves Bali. Is there something we could do for um, anyone who wants to improve themselves and uh, reduce their carbon footprints or reduce their impact? I've been working in more than 30 countries. I've been auditing more than 200 hotels from small size hotel to huge hotel with 800 bedrooms and I would like to use this knowledge I would like to use this um, all that I've se I have seen a lot of things I've seen nice things I've seen bad things and I believe that some of the best practices are not that complicated to implement it's it's not so hard so um, it's possible and that this is the goal of what we are talking about now to to come to your place and to spend one day or two days together and to spot and to see exactly where you can improve and potentially also save some, uh, some money because we are talking about water, we are talking about energy, we are talking about waste, we are talking about human resources, about training, about how your staff is really understanding what you are talking about and about potentially sustainability. And I believe that together we have, we can have, we have a good team together because we, we have uh, a lot of uh, skills that can help and as you said, I mean, sustainability is a big word and uh, it's quite, um, sometimes it's frightening and it's hard, you don't know where to start with and it looks like so many, so many, so many different topics. And I believe that with the service we want to propose to you, we will ease this, uh, this work, we will ease uh, the way you, you go to this path and how you can get uh, some uh, positive results. And for that, for sure, we, we will assess your place and then you will get a report and this report is uh, going to help you for the following months, for the following year. And at the end of this, uh, you will improve what you have been doing. And we are not speaking in this, in this case, we are not speaking about certification, we are not speaking about label, we are just speaking about how to implement the best practices that exist today in the industry and taking into account our different knowledge and, and what we managed to witness from different destinations and also what's happening right now in Bali because we both work in Bali too. Sustainability is becoming something important, more and more important to travelers. They come to Bali, they see the issues and witnessing and, and seeing that you are taking responsibility, that you do what you need to do is something that customers appreciate more and more. Of course, there are some tangible benefits. You know, you're gonna make, you're gonna have savings when we're gonna talk about energy savings, efficiency. Water is a pressing issue in Bali, but you also know that you know there are many things that cannot be dealt in terms of waste. So understanding how you can reduce your waste is something that can really help you on your on your journey. So not only that, but you will see how you will create engagement of your staff. That's often something that is not communicated enough. Is when you embrace sustainability, the guest and the staff love it. The staff will be happier, proud, they love their destination, they love their island, they will see, oh my God, I'm proud of this team, so you will get less issues with uh, staff turnover and stuff. Can tailor made uh, the service proposal because not every hotel has the same needs or every, uh, every uh, accommodation has the same needs, but we are always able to, to focus on a special point if there is anything that you you believe or that you feel needs improvement or something that uh, you don't understand or uh, regarding again all, all these aspects that we mentioned before and uh, and then we can also tailor made uh, any proposal to you so it's very something that is very flexible and that is to to help you to 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 help you better uh, work on this path and to uh, and to 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 reach your goals and that's exactly what we we want to do